Hey, what is going on guys? Um, so today I'm going to be showing you a few cool, um, pretty useful gadgets that you can make using LEDs. So for this first one, I'm going to show you how to make a USB LED nightlight. So there you go guys, this is how to make a mini LED USB device. Um, this thing can be pretty useful. Uh, you can use it as a nightlight. Um, and all you have to do is plug it into a USB brick, which um, I'm sure a ton of you have uh, a bunch of these lying around. So yeah, just, so all you gotta do, is just plug it in, plug it in the wall and there you go. Makeshift nightlight. Or um, you can just leave this by your bed and plug it into your computer. If you ever like lose something and you're too lazy to turn on the lights, um, you can use this. Now for this next one, I'm gonna show you how to add some lights to your shoes. Now I'm not talking about your everyday shoes, I'm talking about like your slippers or shoes you would put on like when you're getting out of bed late at night and you have to go to the bathroom and again you're too lazy to turn on the lights. Um, this is a great hack for that. Now I currently don't have any slippers so I'm going to be doing this, so I'm going to be doing this modification to my flip flops, um, but this will really work on any shoe. I'm going to be using a set of three strip lights, uh, but you can use regular LEDs or anything else like that, um, it'll work the same. So let's get into it. Alright guys, so here's what the finished product should look like. Again, this isn't meant to do on like normal shoes, this is just meant for like um, shoes you would wear to get up to go to the bathroom or something. I mean you could do this to your normal shoes if you wanted and just like hide all the wiring a little bit more. Uh, might look pretty cool, but um, yeah, basically all you gotta do, put on your shoes, flip the switch, and then you can see where you walk. Um, let me kill the light so it'll look a little better, so you can see. Now you don't have to trip over anything. 
And um, I only made one shoe, but uh, the process is exactly the same for the other one. Um, just get another set of lights, throw another battery on there, and you should be good. Alright guys, and so for this last one, I'm going to show you how to turn an ordinary flashlight into a really cool Iron Man light repulsor. So you will need an old flashlight, preferably one with uh, multiple LEDs, um, and all you want to do is just unscrew the top and extract the circuit board. So yeah, I got this one from a flashlight that looks like this. So I just took out the circuit board, and we're left with this. Next, you're going to need something to attach it to your hand. Um, so you could use like an old glove. Um, you could use like a wrist brace or something like that. Um, but to keep the cost down, I'm using this old piece of shirt. Um, and I just attached a few pieces of Velcro to it. So uh, this basically just goes around my hand like this and wraps on like this. Um, and it'll be perfect for what we're doing. So here's how to make it. Alright guys, so there you go, there's how to make an Iron Man wrist palm light. Um, just kind of a cool thing to have, uh, and uh, yeah, pretty easy to make as well. And yeah, before I end it, I want to show you one more really cool thing you can do with lights. So um, here's three cool light products that you can get to turn your room into a light show. Um, the first are these LED strip lights. Now I've done a few videos on these before. Um, I'll add links to all these down below. Um, so if you want to go check them out, basically they're like 15 to 30 bucks, depending on how many you want to get. And they can be controlled by a device that will uh, turn them on and off to the beat of the music. Um, so in another video I actually showed how to make that device. Um, you can also buy it too. So uh, yeah, really cool device. Definitely would recommend checking it out. Um, this other thing I got was this uh, laser. Again, it can be musically controlled. And yeah, it makes a really cool effect on the ceiling. And the last thing I got, it's actually meant for your car, but uh, it's basically like this equalizer that again goes to the music. 
So uh, yeah, if you want to turn your room into a really cool light show, I would recommend getting those three things. Um, so yeah, if you did like this video, don't forget to hit that thumbs up button. Um, click that subscribe button to be notified when I upload new videos. Leave your ideas for cool inventions down in the description. Um, that is pretty much all I've got for today, guys. So I will catch you in the next video.